The Yemeni army has agreed to a five-day truce proposed by Saudi Arabia, which will start on Tuesday, according to Yemen's Saba news agency. This comes after the UN representative in Yemen called recent airstrikes on the country by a Saudi-led coalition, quote, a breach of international law. The coalition has admitted that hospitals and schools have been hit as a result of a recent round of more than 130 attacks. The coalition's operation is aimed at Iranian-backed Houthi rebels who are accused of destabilizing the country. The coalition had previously called on civilians to evacuate Sada, the city in northern Yemen, where Houthi support is strongest. However, it was unclear how they could leave given a shortage of fuel. The coalition spokesman said that the rebels were using the civilians as human shields. We have proven beyond doubt that the Houthi militia prevented Yemeni citizens from evacuating the Sada city through checkpoints and controlling fuel stations and prevent them from leaving and surviving. The UN coordinator for Yemen said that he was, quote, deeply concerned by the indiscriminate bombing, highlighting that, quote, many civilians are effectively trapped in Sada. The airstrikes targeted bases of Houthi leaders across Sada and Haja provinces, as well as hitting the group's tanks and other military vehicles. The Saudi-led coalition and Saudi air forces have carried out 130 sorties since yesterday at 1900 until now. They have targeted 100 targets in Sadar and Maran and on the Kingdom Yemen border. The Saudis and nine other Arab countries, backed by the United States, Britain and France, are hoping to force the Houthis back to their northern heartland and restore Yemen's exiled government of President Abdul Rabu Mansour Hadi.